questions we get asked a lot on Kirka.io. But well, first off is how do you change your texture or your uh, stuff, right? Your sky and your texture and stuff like that. So first off, you want to go to the cog wheel in the top right. Go to your settings. That's what that's called. You want to go all the way over to mods and then you want to go to map. You want to then go to discord so, so if you go to discord you want to join the official kirka.io discord and i'll pop that up and boom so once you're in the official discord you want to go to skyboxes and map textures so map textures we're gonna go there and find a mob map texture that you think is cool this one is made by winky then you want to write uh, copy link or right click it and press copy link and then put it right there and now it changed then you want to go to skybox and put no or yes if you put no you can put it whatever color you want and press yes then you got to change it so if discord and go to skyboxes you can find a skybox that you might want so let's say um let's do this one the copy link and it'll go in order so up is gonna be that if you click it it'll take you to the website so up is normally that I think down is that back is that front left right something like that uh, you might have to uh, mess around a little bit to get it right for this one it's all the same so I don't even have to do that. So boom now it's all the same and now we have a custom sky box and a custom map which is super cool uh, that's how you change that for your cross here it's the same concept so I use a transparent cross here because I have a desktop uh, cross here with my monitor and then sniper scope as well again I use a transparent one and if you're looking for a transparent one you just gotta look it up on Google pretty simple but let's move on to some other common settings how can I get like the best frames stuff like that so for players you can disable textures and that'll give a generic uh, texture on players HP you can enable HP that'll make you a little bit better because you can see the HP bar of players when you kill them you know how low they are weapons you can enable or disable weapons and animations you can enable or disable if you disable animations and weapons you're gonna get more at the frames graphics you want to disable all of this if you disable all of this you'll get more frames cases are bullet cases i don't know why they're called cases it should be bullet cases uh bullets are bullets so like uh when you shoot a wall you see a little bullet hole that's what that is uh smoke is when you shoot a wall smoke comes up so if you want to disable that that'll give you more uh and then holes so i thought that was no, bullets are just what the flying projectile is, and holes are what is on the wall. Yeah, disable all that. Disable shadows. That will... And you want to press no, by the way. I know I'm putting yes, but you want to press no. That's how you disable that. Resolution, if you lower your resolution, which I don't recommend, um, you can get higher frames. Uh, the lower it is, the, the worse the game looks. The higher it is, the better the game looks. Brightness, you can change the brightness. Uh, I also don't recommend doing that. But that's pretty much the basics. I hope that helps you understand um, how to change your skybox, your map texture, and all that stuff. Hopefully that helps. And if it did, definitely hit that like button. Leave a comment down below. And I will see you next time. Bye.